Growing up as a kid, I really liked looking at the stars, and that really gave me a good interest in astronomy, so I wanted to be an astronomer when I was growing up. Hello, my name is Gregory Villar, and I'm a senior at Cal Poly Pomona, and I'm majoring in physics and minoring in mathematics. Right now I'm actually studying objects called planetary nebula and what we're doing is we're trying to classify them in terms of their sizes and shapes. I guess the most exciting thing about planetary nebulas is they come in a wide variety of shapes and sizes which is really quite puzzling considering that they all started as a sphere and it just it's really intriguing to, uh, to be able to understand why this is so and we don't really have a good comprehension of that right now and I guess that's the motivating factor in doing all this research. During my internship, I was able to see other projects going on at JPL, which is really cool to do, as, um, as opposed to just working in my office. I actually visit a lab which works on artificial muscles right now, and I think their overall goal is to build a, um, an artificial muscle that can beat a human in arm wrestling. But that was really, it was a really cool lab to visit. One of my co-interns worked on Athlete, which is one of the coolest things ever. I remember going there one time and seeing all the robotic stuff and it was really cool. It made me want to just like go there and work on it for, for a while. Every so often, maybe like once a month, they took us on field trips. So one would be up to um, the Dryden Center up north. And that was really cool too because we got to see all the, um, the jets and stuff flying around and all the research they're doing over there. Now that I'm in the NASA network, I know there's a lot of opportunities there that I would have a great chance of getting into. After I graduate with my PhD, hopefully come back to JPL and do some more astronomy research. I've always wanted to go into space. So hopefully now that I'm in the NASA network, you know, someday in the future when space travel is more accessible, I'd be in that. And I'd just love to go into space one day. That'd be really awesome.